how to create PayPal accounts in Ghana for free. This is a step-by-step -step tutorial, okay? So as you can see, I've created my PayPal account and I'm having my PayPal balance, okay? I've linked my bank to it. I have done all the verifications, okay? I've verified my ID card. I've done everything, okay? And the issue that we have here when it comes to creating PayPal account in Ghana, I'm going to tell you everything and then show you what you have to do when creating PayPal account here in Ghana, okay? So after receiving money into my PayPal account, this is what happened. PayPal is asking me, to confirm my informations that I provided when I was creating a PayPal account. And for you to know, I created a PayPal account using another countries, okay, in Lesotho, okay. So to see this, let's click on see details, okay. So this is what they are asking from me. They are asking me to again upload my ID card, which I can use my Ghana card. There is no problem with that. But what they have added is that I have to provide a proof of my residence, okay? And I created the PayPal account using Lesotho. I'm in Ghana, but I'm saying that I'm in Lesotho and I created it. So this is the impact. The one with the cross sign, I cannot do any of these. I cannot pay using PayPal, I cannot send money. I cannot do any of these, okay? So let's look at the full impact. I cannot do any of these. I cannot send money, I cannot receive money. I cannot add money to PayPal account. I cannot add bank. I cannot delete the account and, and open it again. I cannot do anything. I cannot close the account, okay? So. This is the whole truth about creating PayPal accounts here in Ghana. If you create it and then you link your bank and then put in your ID card and everything, after you receive money, they will ask you to verify your address, okay? And how can you verify your address? This is what they are asking of you. They say that please upload a document that includes the address associated with your PayPal account. And then the document needs to be valid and then you have to submit the documents and then it should be corresponding to the information you provided when you were creating your PayPal account. And then it shouldn't be older than six months, okay? And they are going to review it according to their policy, okay? So what are the documents that they are asking of me? So let's go to the document type. And as you can see, they are asking of a utility bill, a bank statement, or any other proof of address that states that I am in Lesotho, okay? So that is the issue. So if you created it in UAE, in any of the countries, you have to provide this for them to know that, yes, you are in that country, okay? So if you don't have this, please don't waste your time to create a paper using any other country's name, okay? If you are not in the country, please don't waste your time to create that because you will lose your money. The moment you receive money into your PayPal account, they will ask you to verify your residence. And you and I know that you are not in that country and you are going to lose that money, okay? So how do you create a proper PayPal account? Just go to Google and then type in PayPal, okay? And then just go to the official site of PayPal, okay? Just like this one, just go to the official site of PayPal, okay? So when you go to the official site of PayPal, just like this one, I want you to scroll to the down, okay? Just scroll down and then let's see something over here. You will see that there is a flag of a country here. As you can see, let me zoom in for you to see. Just click on the flag, okay? And then it will show all the countries that are allowed to create paper in Africa, okay? So all these are the countries that are allowed to create paper here in Africa. As you can see, Ghana is not included. We are not allowed to create paper. So what do you have to do? Just look through and then pick any of the countries which is allowed to create paper, okay? For this tutorial, I'm going to use South Africa. As you can see, South Africa is here. Just select the South Africa, okay? So for this tutorial, I'm using South Africa. So as you can see, for South Africa, we can create a business PayPal account. Okay, so the next thing that you have to do is to go back to Google again. Okay, now that we know that you can create PayPal accounts in South Africa, just go to Google again and then type in Upwork. Okay, and then when it comes, just select the official site of Upwork. Okay, this one, just select it. Since we are not in South Africa, we need somebody who is in South Africa to create the account for us. Okay, so just go to the search bar and then search for a virtual assistant, okay? 
just select this one and you will see a lot of people who are working as a visual assistant okay so let's go and then sort it out and then filter it out based on location which is south africa so we just type in south africa here and then when it comes just select the south africa and then we are going to see only visual assistants who are living in south africa so as you can see this person is in south africa just scroll through and then look at the one that you think the person can work for you okay so for this tutorial i'm going to select this person and then just come in and sign up if you haven't signed up already just click on the sign up okay so when you click on the sign up you can easily sign up using your google account okay just sign up using your google account and then come back here to the person's profile as you can see we have the copy here just copy the link to the clipboard so after copying it the next thing is to just come back and then when you look at the top corner you can see we have the telegram symbol here just click on it you can use it to send the person direct contact okay you can create a direct contact and or invite the person and then talk to the person okay so all that you have to do is just put in the client's name the client's email address the description why you want to contact the person okay and then click on the next so the person will respond to you when they respond to you tell them that you want them to create a paypal account a verified paypal account with your ID card and then your email address using their own residential address in South Africa so that when you encounter any difficulty they will be the one to verify it for you okay so that is the only working way now that you can create PayPal account here in Ghana but they are going to charge you something small okay but if you want to create a PayPal alternative, an account that works just like PayPal for free. Look in the video description. I'm having a video link. Just watch it and then create the best PayPal alternative, which is free. So like the video and then see you in my next video.